German guys are cool dudes. I can't even say it enough. What's that you say? You're interested in dating a German? I've got the secret. It's one of my favorite topics to talk about. I love, love, love talking about dating. And I love talking about what it's like to live in Germany. And the reason I'm in Germany is because I dated a German. So let's go ahead and kick it off with what it's like to date a German boy. My best friend will vouch for this. I am very, very on record saying I would never date a German. Never. I could never even imagine it. Never, 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 never. And here we are. Not only have I dated a German, I married one. So, dating a German has been super duper fun. They're very different. I guess I should start off with how I even met Max. Basically, Max and I met in Australia, and he, I love to ask him, like, I'll do a video on how we met. Somebody searching for bathrooms? Bathrooms? This direction. So basically what it's like to date a German boy is you have a lot of conversations that are mm, pretty serious. It is for protein powder. You should, I think you should uh, put M&Ms in it. The senses of humor are different. Like Germans have a very literal sense of humor. I'm gonna have to think of the joke that Max said last night. Um, and it was, it was really funny, but it was also so literal. Um, and Americans are really like, the irony of it all is so funny. Germans really like to be together as a family. They like to sit down with each other. They like to have conversations. They really like to talk back and forth. And I just feel like in American culture, that was something that we really like had a hard time with at the beginning of our relationship. I always wanted to sit in front of the TV and eat. And that was like, Germans love to sit together, they love to hang out, they love to chat, they love to catch up on their days, they talk about everything. Also in America, I feel like a lot of families, like we have that like typical Matilda movie scene where like everybody has like TV dinners. And right now, we are eating dinner and watching TV. We would sit at the table and I just like, I don't know what it is, but I really had a hard time with that. So Max and I, um, that's something that he's kind of budged on and now we eat in front of the TV But we do have conversations and stuff other places Germans have I can't even tell you the m amount of respect that German men have for women and also the like The manners that are instilled in them just as an entire culture like German men stand up They give their seat to other people like everybody's just very aware of not just themselves but everybody else around them and that's something so different from like the guys that i had dated in the past from different countries they're just very helpful like i remember the first time that i came to germany to visit max we were in this like coffee shop that i had been wanting to try and i remember we were sitting there and then something happened where she turned away like with whatever she was carrying and it fell off and broke and there was a line of men, like men in front of her in line, men in behind her in line, men sitting down. Like really it was like a coffee shop full of men and we were the two women in it. And every single guy, they bend over and they all just start picking up her stuff. And I, I like, I literally was shocked. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't, you'll never see that in the United States. Never, ever, ever. All of these guys are like too business, too busy, too in a hurry. Like they're in line to get their coffee. Never would they bend down and help this little pregnant lady pick up her glass. But even Max turned around and was like sussing the situation out to see if he could help. So that leads into my third point. They're also very helpful. Like, they're not lazy guys. If I'm folding the clothes, Max will come and help me fold the clothes. If I'm doing the laundry, Max will hang the laundry. It's a really well-balanced, like, relationship, honestly. Like, I feel very supported, but I also see that just, like, when I'm at work. If I need help, a guy always comes. They're helpful. They're helpful people. It's awesome. Honestly, I have nothing bad to say about it. Really, it's very impressive. They're very just a respectful culture. It's like, German guys are really raised with a lot of respect. And they're very protective. If you come to Germany, in Germany, you're trying to learn the language, like you show German people that you're trying to work, you're trying to learn their language, you're trying to like respect their culture. They will take you in and they are so protective over you. It's so cool. Like I can't even tell you, I've 
Honestly, I don't know. Like, I could get overwhelmed if I thought about it too much. I guess, like, the women in Germany, but that's probably, like, a different video. I don't think I'm gonna touch on that in this video. But always the men have been, like, very, like, protective. Like, they're just looking out for each other, looking out for everybody. So other men, guys in Germany hug each other, they like kiss each other on the cheeks, they're very like affectionate with each other, not embarrassed, like it's never a macho like, oh no, oh, like it's so, it's so stupid. Really like German guys are cool dudes. I can't even say it enough. My best friend's dating a guy from England and I hear the best things about him. When I was there, he was like sending her stuff, but I think he's an anomaly in England. Hey Akash, shout out to you. You're fine. I just wish that you guys could date a German guy. It's so fun. It's so cool. It's so relaxed. I just feel like they really help you out. They're so respectful of you and other people. It's not just you. Like German guys are not like worried about like what's up inside of their tiny little bubble, they're also looking out for everybody else. And I just think that that's such a weird thing coming from the United States. Um, that's not the case there. And so Max would be so open about like talking about his money. It was so crazy. Like he was like, oh yeah, this costs this, this is this, like here's a discount here. Here's like no discount. This is where you can get a better deal. Like. I, I'm willing to invest this much. I'm not willing to invest this much. Like this is how much my paycheck was. I'm very on top of it. And like really on top of his finances and then vocal about them with everybody. And in the United States, like it's you're told at work, like you shouldn't share how much money you make. And like, um, it's very hush hush. And like, oh, does, do, do they make more money than me? Or like, am I making more money than them? And it's a very weird mentality around money. I feel like all of the people that I'm surrounded with or like by are very vocal about money because it is, it's a massive aspect in anybody's life. And so I think that when you date somebody who talks to you about finances, like you're in a better place. Like you're just more aware of everything that goes on. And so Germans are like that. Germans are so active and so sporty. And so Max is always like, do you wanna go, do you wanna go for like a walk? Do you wanna go for a run? Like, let's go run together. Like blah, 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 like let's go, I don't know, kick a ball in the park and I'm just sitting there like, no. The German guys totally value their friendships. All of these guys are really solid dudes. I think it's just so interesting. It's not just a bunch of guys that hang out with and go grab a beer and it's not very deep. All of them are calling each other and having really big talks. It's really interesting. Max will sit on the phone with one of his best friends and just like talk about his kid. What's up with them? What's new? What's different? And Max is lit up with joy. I feel like guys in the US are like really quiet about their relationships. German guys also have really interesting styles. So they're very, clean cut dudes or they're really like edgy hip hop. It's really so funny or sporty. I guess they have three styles. That's kind of what it's like to date a German guy. I think that everybody should try. If you haven't, you're missing out, really. German guys are awesome. I glow talking about them. I think if you're ready to settle down, you want a cool guy that's gonna talk to you about responsibility, that's gonna talk to you about communication, about your finances, how you should invest in your long-term life and who really cares about others, himself, his friends, his family, come to Germany. I'd recommend it. Okay guys, that's all for today. So thanks for watching. The next video, I see you. I'll be talking to you about what it's like to date an American and get your heart broken by an American boy. What a movie scene, my expertise. And then also what it's like to date a British boy and get your heart broken by a British boy. They're all different. Thank God I've never had my heart broken by a German boy. I don't think you would recover. So maybe stick to when you're ready to settle down to date a German. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps my channel. Also, it's so exciting. Leave a comment. I love to hear what you guys have to say. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Cool. And don't forget to check out my other videos. I think they're super fun. If you have any suggestions or things that you'd like to see, feel free to let me know. I'm open to trying. Bye.